everybody, we're back here with uh, young uh, Ms. Olivia Wilde. Uh, Olivia Wilde. I want to talk about some of the hard work that you did, and that is directing yourself. Because, oh. as I said, you're a character in this, and you, you're a fun character in this. Yeah. Like, especially, I love the fact that this uh, young oh. lady right here, who yeah. plays your daughter, is your daughter. She is my real right daughter. There. That's, That's your Daisy. daughter Daisy, right there. And she was very good at playing my daughter. Mm -hmm. um, there's a lot wonderful. of, there's many funny lines of you yelling at your yeah. children off camera going, don't do that, don't hit her. Yeah, yeah, Whatever. exactly. Uh, was that a natural way that you speak to your own children? I was a little meaner in the movie than I would be to her. It was okay. like the drunk 1950s version of me, I guess. Mm -hmm. But um, it was really great to have her there. And I really loved that she was seeing me in that light. You know, I thought, oh good, like somewhere subconsciously this is seeping in, that her mother is in charge and is supported by this awesome crew. I in charge like, and performing in it. What is that like to direct yourself? I mean, it's insane. It was insane because I was also producing the movie. So it would be, you know, like acting the scene in a bikini, which just makes it weird, and sure. then getting up, like holding my daughter, running over to the monitor, talking to my DP, then the other producers telling me about like COVID shutdowns and all sorts of insanity, and then sitting down, calling action, doing it again. It was wild. Was there a particular type of scene that you enjoyed? Was it was it a comedy or the suspense? Because there's some few moments there that do make your skin crawl. Yes. You're not sure what's about to happen in the yes. scene. All that stuff was so fun. I think my favorite stuff to direct were the action sequences, though. I love car chases. What I really want to do is like Fast is and Furious 45 or whatever what they're is, on. What's happening? Oh, there? yeah. That okay, so this is this is a rig called the biscuit rig, which is how you shoot high-speed car chases. And it's really fun. It's basically like the best Disneyland ride you can imagine. And I got to be whipped around as Florence was pretending to drive this amazing 60s Corvette. And it was like the greatest day of my life, week of my life. And that made me realize that, yeah, I just want to direct like crazy action sequences. <laughs> um, your character, Bunny, yes. um, uh, has got a hell of a pair of eyebrows. Um, is there, <laughs> <laughs> she's a recognizable character. She's sort of an archetype yes. of, of, of uh, mid-century uh, as I said, sort of an unsettling utopia. Is there an inspiration for her? Yes, she's very much based on my grandmother, Jean, um, who was a really fabulous woman who was incredibly brilliant. And she largely lived to kind of create a very fabulous life for her family, it was a, mm. a wonderful wife, a very glamorous wife. But I always thought, you know, like she was very well educated, she studied poetry, she was very well read, but her existence, her existence was largely based around her husband. And I thought, you know, I wonder really what it would be like to get into her skin, because though I could kind of judge the lack of autonomy at the time, it also seemed like a really fabulous life. <laughs> like, they partied a lot. Yeah, they had better, they had better clothes than they did. They had did. better clothes. They dressed up to fly. We, I, I fly looking very bad, just a lot of sweatpants. <laughs> so messy, but you know, Jean was always fabulous. And I thought, okay, for a minute, I'll get to be as fabulous as Grim Jean. Anybody in the family recognize her in the performance? Oh yeah, my siblings saw it the other night and they were like, aha! <laughs> and it was great. And oh. I think that, you know, I think she would have been really proud of it. And I think, uh, you know, if I had told her that I would be directing movies at this mm -hmm. scale, I, I think she wouldn't have believed that it was possible. So. That's really cool. Well, what's next? What are you working on next? So many fun things. Um, I'm making a documentary now, and a few projects are in development. But, you know, it's been three years. I'm excited to just get this baby out. It's like I've been mm -hmm. pregnant for a 1,000 months. <laughs> 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 I don't know how many months are in three years. Don't quiz me. Um, but mm -hmm. then just to see it in theaters and just like have people own it on their own, and, and then I will rest for a small period of time and get back in the game. Well, Olivia, it was lovely to see you. Thank you Thank so much you for being so here. Much. Thank you. Thank Don't you. worry, darling is in theaters Friday. Olivia Wilde, everybody. We'll be right back with Ukraine's foreign minister, Dmitro Kuleba.